Hey, I'd like to welcome you to another episode of the Mission Matters Business Podcast, your source for all things business. My name is Adam Torres. You can follow me on Instagram at Ask Adam Torres. Keep up with my book releases, book tour schedule, signings, all that other good stuff. Always love to connect with you there. And as always, if you'd like to apply to become a co-author of one of my upcoming books, just head on over to the website, missionmatters.com, and click on Become an Author to Apply. All right, so today I have Tanya Bogotai on the line, and she's a leadership and transformational coach over at Tanya Bogotai Coaching. Tanya, welcome to the show. Thank you. Hello, Adam, and um, pleasure being here, honored to be here, and thank you for the opportunity to spend uh, this time with you and um, public of your uh, podcast. Thank you. Thank you, and uh, I'm excited to get into today's topic. So we're going to talk more about the hashtag uh, Be Powerful and Free platform that you've created. So I'm really excited to get into this. We're also going to talk about empowerment for life, leadership, impact, and we've got a lot to cover here in a short amount of time. Um, just to start out with, um, tell us a little bit more about your background. How did you get started in your career? Well, uh, I started uh, first being a public official. I've done one career in public administration, uh, working with leaders, being a leader uh, in public sector in government of Slovenia. But then three years ago, uh, I became entrepreneur, become professional coach. But I'm in coaching since 2011. So when I got uh, into coaching, I knew this is something that I'm going to be doing. But that uh, I needed several years of experiences uh, working as a leader with people and I also then specialized in leadership coaching and uh, used coaching uh, in my leadership uh, and improved uh, personally and professionally through it. Uh, and now I just enjoy working with people um, because I can help so much more, I can achieve so much more, you can imagine, like in government, it's a very limited environment. Uh, but here, uh, when I work with people with their potentials uh, and transforming limitations and then achieving goals, it just uh, brightens me up and keeps me going. So it's exciting. Oh, that is exciting. Um, let's uh, let's get a little bit further to today's topic. So let's start off with uh, with going a little bit further into your practice and tell us a little bit more about the hashtag Be Powerful and Free platform that you've created. Yeah, it started actually when I prepare, where I was preparing myself to leave the system in a way to leave the uh, governmental job. I become a coach, leadership coach, and at one point I was really, everyone was a coach. There was a lot of bad coach. Uh, everyone was leader. Uh, a lot of talking about leadership. There was just a lot of uh, bad leadership around me as well. And I was um, thinking, thinking, and digging deeper what's behind. And for me, I came to the conclusion that there were always uh, two things, two words, in a way, to describe it, power and freedom, and how we struggle, in a way, uh, with these uh, two uh, elements. Uh, so I created uh, a program behind that, uh, with a mission behind it. And I believe if we are all um, as safe, as free, as we need to be to feel in our power, uh, to express ourselves and to give our gifts. I believe that we give our best and with that we can create also way better things. Uh, we are more open to learn and create with others and I think in the long run we create better worlds. So uh, it became passion, it became my journey, a uh, continuing journey of learning, unlearning, relearning uh, and helping people to come back to themselves to be uh, empowered by being themselves and not losing for this cause uh, either a job, either relationships, uh, their health, but achieve even more uh, with being authentic self, I would say. That's awesome. Um, tell us a little bit more about your actual coaching program. So there's some people listening right now that um, maybe they're looking for coaching or they've been looking for a, what kind of coach is going to work right for them. Um, what are, tell us a little bit more about the program and the type of clients that are usually a good fit for you. Yeah, it uh, turned out that I'm very successful with this program that I've created. There are more than 10 programs um, already prepared in a way, but open to be personalized for each individual client or teams or organizations uh, because I believe that we are unique. And I like to establish personal contact and uh, spend some time in uh, getting to know uh, clients and then uh, I adjust these programs either in content-wise, uh, format-wise, or uh, in time manner. And also financial part is usually the input that we uh, play around it. Uh, so 
all are based on empowerment, leadership, and impact. I believe that we are leaders of our lives, and if we uh, manage or develop the skills how to self-lead, that's the prerequisite to do anything you do in life uh, better, or you know how to do, or you're just open uh, to do it better and better. Uh, and usually my clients are, uh, first they come from professional reasons, they want to achieve bigger goals, either go from one stage to international business, or they are in between jobs uh, during a certain uh, period of career that they lack passion, that they uh, want to get it back, or they are successful but not enjoying that much, or they are not any more successful like they are used to. And then they also come when life happens, I say. Uh, so not that something in the business uh, sector happened, but uh, actually something in private lives. But this is everything that affects us as human beings or in uh, leadership or business-wise. And these are like relationship uh, challenges, um, health issues, financial issues, just big changes in life that we uh, here and then encounter. And sometimes it's... Um, not that it's easier just with a coach, but some things we cannot solve on our own or we need uh, too much time or we just uh, run in circles instead of getting professional help because uh, we can learn to do things better, differently, because what maybe was good a few years ago, now it's just not working anymore, um, and we can learn how to do it better now. So uh, these are the clients, usually entrepreneurs of um, small businesses, some medium-sized uh, businesses, because they just see that either need to, they need to develop on the next level to delegate things, to not do too many functions in one row, or to uh, sustain the business and provide for uh, their employees, uh, for the business, but then they find themselves that they are not really uh, leaders or uh, they, they want to be in the production or in operational things. So we learn either skills to be better at or we um, come to conclusion uh, what's best for them and then uh, I help them take better decisions. Uh, I had a client uh, who was an entrepreneur and did everything to have a good company and running company, sacrificed more or less everything for 18 years, but then uh, fell into deep depression, being uh, burnout, and he wanted to sell everything immediately. So we needed to work first on his uh, health, his well-being, his energy, but now he's running a um, multinational company and is, uh, again, very successful and harmonized in life. So these are usually the clients. So they come with one challenge or one struggle, but then we find out that maybe this is the pattern that repeats somewhere else. And usually in coaching we say what you learn in one aspect, only in one area, you can then multiply in somewhere else. So whatever they learned within the business as leadership, uh, they can then use with their uh, children, with their spouses, or uh, in their life in general. Um, so it's usually leaders, individuals, with small teams, up to 15 people, but, uh, people, but then also bigger organizations. Uh, but here we do uh, more um, workshops, trainings, and then some leaders within these teams uh, get additional one-on-one -on -one coaching or team coaching. So That's this awesome. variety of coaching, consultancy, it could be also mentorship, but then training of uh, specific skills or um, um, to become leaders, better leaders, or to create the impact that they want to create. So Tanya, if somebody's listening to this and they want to connect with you and your team to learn more about the hashtag Be Powerful and Free platform or about your coaching services, I mean, what's the best way for them to connect and to reach out? Well, best way just to connect because I do first uh, just talk. We do the conversation and then we see where we are at if we want to collaborate further. So all the information is also on my website. So it's www.tanyabogatai.com. Uh, and also my email address, tanyabogataicoating uh, at uh, gmail.com. So um, or on social media, I'm present, but just reach out and then we'll connect, uh, make conversation, and uh, I can share the information that they uh, seek for, and also if I can help uh, the coach in their challenges or goals that they have. And for Be Powerful and Free, uh, that's um, a special website, but it's on my website, it's the link. 
but it's additional it's www.bepowerfulandfree.com and uh, there is a platform for sharing stories uh, where I invite people that inspire me, that I encounter, and I see that they could be great value uh, to share their power or leader stories uh, further on. So if your audience is uh, interested to be also part of this platform, I'll be more than um, happy to share the story uh, and also how to prepare it, but it's very simple. I just invite people to be who they are and share uh, what it means for them to be powerful and free and uh, to be uh, authentic, to use the story of their life, either personal or professional. So it's open invitation. Fantastic. Well, Tanya, I really appreciate you coming on the show today and uh, sharing more about your background and all the great stuff you're doing as a coach and over at hashtag Be Powerful and Free. So awesome stuff there. And to the audience, as always, thank you for tuning in. Hope you got a lot of value out of this. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the podcast, uh, leave me a review on the Apple iTunes store. And if you're watching this on our YouTube channel, Mission Matters Business, definitely give us a subscribe there, but also leave us some comments in the video. Love to know what kind of projects and things that you're working on. And Tanya, thanks again for coming on the show. Thank you. It was a pleasure and wish a lot of success to you and your audience. Thank you.